Okay, art buddies, here is another art activity that we're going to do when we get together. We're going to make these ornaments. It's going to start off this big and it's going to end up this big. Yes, I have the power to shrink your Christmas ornaments. It's very exciting. Now, I've already cut out the shape of the Christmas ornaments, so let's get all the things we need together. We need some colored pencils, a couple of metallic pens, and the Christmas ornament that's all ready for you. I've even colored the top to make it look like a Christmas ornament for you. Now, there's two sides to this um, shrinky dink material. One is rough and one is smooth. You're going to want to draw on the side that's a little bit rough. And you can draw whatever you'd like. I'm going to make a snowman, but you could do Santa or a snowflake or some holly or bells, or you could just write your name, make it all fancy with your name on there. Um, it's entirely up to you. But you want to do a nice job coloring. And let's give this little guy a hat and some eyes. And of course he needs a carrot for the nose and uh, some arms. What are some other things you could draw? Stars, stockings, anything you'd like. Give him a little scarf because he might get cold. And then I'm going to put some ground in here so it doesn't look like he's floating in the air. And then let's use a metallic pen and put some details on his hat. Oh, this pen's not working so well. Let's switch over to silver. So I'm going to put some a silver band on his hat. And I'm going to put the date. I'm just going to put 2013. That way if we hang this on a Christmas tree, every year that we go to put it on the tree, we'll remember exactly when we made it. And I'm also going to put my name on here. If you guys could put your name on your ornament, that would be really great. It would make your parents happy and would make my life a little bit easier. Now here is the magic oven. Oh, this is my favorite part of this project. So we're going to take your ornament. Now one of the teachers has to do this. You're not allowed to touch the oven. I'm going to pop it in there. And let's see what happens. Oh my goodness, it's shrinking up. I never get tired of watching this. Oh no. Wait, wait for it. Wait for it. Here it comes. It's coming back into its normal shape, I hope. And look at that. Excellent. It's back and it's shrunk. It's now one quarter the size it was and it's eight times as thick as it was before. That's pretty exciting. All right, now the teacher has to take it out of the oven and then there you have your finished ornament. You can make a necklace out of it or put it on your tree. All right, let's get to work.